Alright, what's good y'all? Welcome back. You know, there's another installment of the Daily Food Reviews. And as you see right here, we have some cosmic brownies. It's divided into three portions because we got my boy Josh on camera. Toodles. My boy right here, Dr. F. Chum. And Eric, or Easy e You know, um, y'all might be wondering why I got this paper. And that's just because I just want to show how much I appreciate y'all by cutting this paper, you know. The face of a man cutting paper. That concentration, that drive. Ooh. Yeah, what y'all thought? I love y'all. <laughs> That's actually a perfect heart. <laughs> yeah, it was a perfect heart. I cut it myself. All right. All right, it's time to get serious. All right, since I touched this one, I'll get this side. All right, so we don't. It's this side, you got a whole piece. How's it aside? Yes. Is it on the piece? So, so it's on this one. Okay, anyways. Uh, I'm going to dive into this. If y'all want to, y'all can too. I'm going to try this. Um. <laughs> oh, it's soft. I wasn't expecting it to be soft. Mm. It's nice and soft. Mm. Good. Very cosmic. Mm. <laughs> no, it tastes just like a brownie, but it has a different texture, you know. It's more like a brownie with the texture of a soft cookie. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? I understand. I understand. How do you feel about this, Eric? Shoot, it's pretty good. I like how soft it is, but like, right when I bit into it, I nutted. Automatically. Alright, esports, esports. But, um, you know what? Whenever you eat a brownie, you like to get that thick uh, bread, like cake taste. It's like a chocolate. <laughs> but, uh, <ooh. laughs> uh, but, you know, it's like a chocolate cake besides way more chocolate, you know. Like they they pound the chocolate up into a brownie, and I like the dark brownies. Ooh. Hey, for any of y'all ladies who watch this, I see you too. Hey, um, well, according to our demographic, there's only one girl that watches our um videos, and know. it's probably Kim. <laughs> shout outs to Kim. Shout, shout outs to Kim for being uh, our demographic, but um. If I'm gonna rate this brownie, this cosmic brownie, I don't know what cosmic means. News team, look up cosmic. All right. All right. So we're learning what cosmic means. I've heard it before. You know, I've heard like cosmic spirit, which was a skin name for one of my Rosalina skins I had back in the day. But um, I'm gonna go ahead and rate this. Um, on a casual level is great you have a box of them there's like 12 in a box probably more depending on the size of the box anyways um it's like a little brownie you don't have to cook you tote it around say in a box this brownie box was in a closet back there and it ain't even melted Ooh, that's convenience that is convenience on top of convenience you see the what does cosmic mean? Relating to universe or cos or cosmos, especially as distinct from the Earth or inconceivably vast. So that. So this inconceivably vast brownie. <laughs> is that what you're saying? Yeah. That is what it's saying. Facts. All facts. Of, all of these facts of it being cosmic has to do with why it was so perfect back there up in that closet. Yeah. It's like dealing with the entire cosmos. It's like. You have brownies since the beginning of the cosmos. Think about it. It's so vast. Ooh. Vast brownies. Anyways, as I was saying, as I was rating it, very convenient, really good. It's one of those things I only want to eat like one of though, because I don't, I don't like eating too much like thick 
Chocolate. I mean, I'm going to have to let it slide. I mean, I'm going to let it slide. But, um, but I'm going to give it a solid 7 out of 10. And on a professional level, you can't beat an actual brownie. Like, an actual homemade, your grandma, she, she cooking on her last Thanksgiving brownie. That, that type of brownie. That's her last great. Thanksgiving, that's a high oh, yeah. standard they gotta, right there. They got to... They gotta go out like like no other Thanksgiving before. Hmm. And by the way, to all the haters that don't like Thanksgiving, whenever it became a holiday holiday in the United States, it wasn't for killing a bunch of Indians. Is to celebrate our victories. George Washington didn't say anything about slaughtering Indians. I know that happened on the first Thanksgiving, but y'all need to relax. Why we celebrate it is not because of that. So y'all Thanksgiving haters, back off. For one thing, for one thing. Anyways, um, hold it. Okay. Anyways, what we're going to Toodles to give the professional review. All right, on this, on this food we just ate on the Cosmic Brownie that's so good. It's named Cosmic, and representing a lot. I felt it. I felt it just like the makers of it. And uh, you know what? On a cash flow level, I think I'll give it an eight. A little bit working with you on oh. your side. Yes. <laughs> and uh, it's it's so convenient. It's so it's there. And for some reason, even if it was there, I felt like I don't know how long I've seen that brownie there, but it was so soft and smooth. You can just pick that up any day you like. Keep it there for a month. Keep it there for three months. Could just eat it. It's still soft. Nice. So that's 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 really convenient. <laughs> See facts. All right, Eric. You have anything to say? So yeah, I gotta agree with my boy Toodles. I give it like eight out of ten because you go to like Dollar General or like Dollar Tree. They have these like trash one dollar boxes of these trash brownies. No. Cosmic you brownies just, good. You just raise, raise that money up a tiny bit and boom, Cosmic brownies. All right, Josh, uh, hold this one more time. <laughs> I any of y'all trying to fact check me and say that Abraham Lincoln made it a holiday, George Washington made it a holiday first, but it was on a state level and it didn't become a national holiday till Abraham Lincoln rolled up. So y'all even try to fact check me because George Washington said to celebrate it first. I'm not saying the past is good. I'm saying why we celebrate it is good. So y'all get off Thanksgiving. Hey, I made a tweet about that. And I probably had to rate it uh, on a professional food reviewer uh, level. I'll rate it uh, seven, seven out of 10 for me. Seven out of 10 because I don't really have brownies. I'm from another country, but what about you? Are, you are a brownie. All right, here's what happened. <laughs> <laughs> here's what happened. Professional food reviewer. All right. What you think? That's what I think. <laughs> <laughs> right, for Professionally, I have to get that uh, like. An 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. So Alright, that's. Sorry for that interruption. That about does it for this food review. Upcoming announcements. Upcoming announcements. <laughs> QA. Coming up very soon. Ask more questions. I keep telling that every single video. I never ask any questions. And that was not milk. It was lemonade. For any of y'all trying to fact check me. Alright, we got one minute left in this video. We're, uh, we're hitting the nine minute mark. Mm. Ooh. We're lagging a little behind here. Lagging right. a little bit behind. Okay, um, yeah. Y'all comment questions. Demographic? Y'all young boys? Y'all young girls? And y'all 20 to 30 year old women need to start watching the videos because our demographics look bad. You know what? There's a 25% of people who haven't subscribed but are watching our videos. And y'all <laughs> that are watching our videos and aren't subscribed, y'all hit that button. Y'all hit that supreme red rectangle button and subscribe. I would appreciate it. <laughs> That would be Ooh. greatly appreciated. Yeah, it would be yeah. greatly appreciated. 
Not 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 saying you have to or anything. Yeah, I but mean, it'd be you don't great. have to. It's free country. You do whatever you want. That's it's America. But subscribe. All right. Bye bye. All right. We out.